from Denver, Colorado, it's theCUBE, covering Supercomputing 17, brought to you by Intel. Hey, welcome back everybody. Jeff Frick here with theCUBE. We're at Supercomputing 2017 in Denver, Colorado. It's our first trip to the show. 12,000 people, a lot of exciting stuff going on. Big iron, big lifting, heavy duty compute. And we're excited to have our next guest on. He's Jim Wu. He's the Director of Customer Experience for Falcon Computing. Jim, welcome. Thank you. Good to see you. So what does Falcon do for people that aren't familiar with the company? Yeah, Falcon Computing is an early stage startup focused on APGA based acceleration development. Our vision is to allow software engineers to develop APGA based accelerators without APGA expertise. Right, and you just said you just closed your B round, so congratulations on that. Thank you. Yeah, very exciting. So it's a pretty interesting concept, you know, to, to really bring kind of the capability to traditional software engineers to program for hardware. That's kind of a new concept. What do you think? Is, you know, because it brings the power of, of a hardware system, but the flexibility of a software system. Yeah, so today, uh, to develop APGA accelerators is very challenging. So today, for the uh, acceleration space, people use a very low-level language like a Verilog and the VHDL to develop APGA accelerators, which is very time-consuming, very labor-intensive. So our goal is to uh, liberate them uh, to use C or C++-based uh, design flow right. to give them uh, an environment that uh, they are familiar with in C, C++. So not only they can improve their uh, productivity, we also do a lot of uh, automatic optimization under the hood to give them the highest quality of results. Right, so that really opens up the ecosystem well beyond the relatively small ecosystem that knows how to program the hardware. Definitely, that's uh, what we are hoping to, to see. We want to, uh, the tool to, in the hands of all the software uh, programmers, they can use it in the cloud, they can use it in, uh, on premises. Okay, so what's the name of your product and how does it fit within the stack? I know we've got We've got the Intel microprocessor under the covers, we've got the accelerator, we've got the cards, there's a lot of pieces to the puzzle. Yeah. So where does Falcon fit? So uh, our main product is a uh, compiler called the Merlin Compiler. Okay. It's a uh, pure C and the C++ flow that uh, enables software programmers to design APGA-based accelerators without any knowledge about APGA. And it's highly integrated with uh, Intel uh, development tools, so users don't even need to learn anything about the Intel development environment. They can just use their C++ development environment, then in the end, we give them uh, the host code as well as APGA binaries, so they can run on APGA to see accelerated applications. Okay, and how long, how long has Merlin been GA? Uh, actually, <laughs> Uh, we'll be uh, GA uh, early next year. Early next year, okay. Yeah, so, so you're so still, still uh, finishing, doing the final polish here and there. Yes, so in this quarter, we are heavily investing a lot of uh, ease of use features. Okay. We, we have uh, most of the features we want to be in the tool, and, but uh, we're still lacking a little bit in, the, in terms of uh, ease of use. Uh, okay. So we are enhancing our report capabilities. We are enhancing our profiling capabilities. We want to really truly like a traditional C++, C++ C++ based development environment for software application right. engineers. Okay, that's fine. You got to get you want to get it done right before you ship it out the door. So do you have some alpha programs going on, some beta programs with some early early adopters? Yeah, exactly. So today we provide a 14 day free trial to any customers who are interested. We have it. Uh, uh, you can set up in your uh, enterprise or you can set up on the cloud. Okay. We provide uh, to where you, you want to uh, your work done. Okay, and so you'll support all the cloud service providers, the big public clouds, all the private clouds, all the kind of traditional data centers as well. Right, so yeah, the, we are, our tool is already on uh, AWS as well as uh, Alibaba Cloud. So we are working on uh, bringing the tool to other uh, public pro cloud providers as well. Right. So what is some of the early feedback you're getting from some of the people you're talking to as to where this is going to make the biggest impact? Who, what, what type of application space has just been waiting for this, for this uh, solution? So uh, our Merlin compiler is a uh, uh, productivity tool. So any space that APGA can traditionally play well, that's where we want to, to be there. So like uh, encryption, decryption, video codec, 
uh, compression, decompression, those kind of applications are very suitable for APJ. Now, uh, traditionally, they can only be uh, developed by hardware engineers. Now, with the Merlin compiler, all these software engineers can use uh, the Merlin compiler to do all these applications that's well suited for APJs. Okay, and when is it? When is it GA again? Now, now I know it's coming. When when is it coming? So approximately, I want probably to first quarter of uh, 2018. Okay, that's just right around the corner. Exactly. All right, super. And again, a little bit about the company. How many people are you? A little bit of the background on the uh, on the founders. So uh, we have uh, about 30 employees uh, at the moment. So we have offices in. Uh, Santa Clara, which is our headquarter. We also have an office in uh, Los Angeles as well as uh, Beijing, China. Okay, great. All right, well, Jim, thanks for taking a few minutes. We'll be looking for uh, for GA in a couple of uh, a couple of months, and wish you nothing but the best success. Okay, thank you so much, Jeff. All right, he's Jim Wu. I'm Jeff Frick. You're watching the Q from Supercomputing 2017. Thanks for watching.